Hello YouTuber Reservoir Warrior here, and as promised, <clears throat> I got my three boxes of Toon Chaos to open up, and yes, we are doing all three in one video. Now unfortunately, uh, no OTS this time. I did get OTS. I actually got 15 packs of OTS for buying these three boxes. Oh, and I forgot to bring something. That's okay, I got that uh, Eternity Code mouse pad you get. Actually, let me, uh, no, it's okay. I got that, uh, little Eternity Code mouse pad, uh, you get, that, or that came with, I guess, the, uh, quote-unquote sneak peek kit, but, uh, anyway, uh, regardless, I didn't want to wait to open packs, so I just opened up all the OTS, and out of the last pack, I did get the ultimate rare I wanted, which was, uh, Trap Tricks of Reflasia, so I was really happy about that. And then my friend Jeremy from his box actually pulled two of the ultras I really wanted, which was uh, Gearfried and uh, Renaud. So, glad I have those two, hoping to get one more Renaud and one more Gearfried, because my friend AJ went to Walmart, got packs, and pulled a Renaud as well. So, that's what we're hoping for. And then, of course, a Collector's Rare, which, you know, I'm not going to be upset if I pull one. I'm not too crazy about those Collector's Rares anyway. But regardless, I'm excited to finally open this set. My LCS did get them late, but on the bright side, they didn't charge like this crazy high prices for these. Because I know a lot of places are selling these for 100. My LCS charged 80. They only got two cases, though. My friend Darren bought a case. And as always, I'll leave a link to his eBay page in the description. And if I pull a, uh, if I somehow pull a, uh, Collector's Rare Stardust Dragon, that's going to my friend Brandon. But we have a lot of packs to open up, so, and I'm sure you guys have seen a plethora of openings, so I'm just going to steamroll through these. Oh yeah, I forgot the, uh, foils in the center. That's going to throw me off so much. I forgot about that. It's not like Euro print where it's in the back like it should be, but. Got some nifty reprints in this set. Fun set of for GOAT format, too, honestly. Hoping for the Warriors since this set I'm reviving my uh, Equip Warriors. Because originally I was just going to build Ignoble Knights, but. When I found out we're getting uh, cards from the uh, Warrior Structure Deck Japan God that they skipped over for us in this set. Like, okay, I guess I can build those. So far, we haven't pulled any yet, but I mean, out of three boxes, it's not bad. This card's interesting. I am i don't run it, though. It's just a little too slow for me. But still, this is one of the uh, collector's rares I wouldn't mind pulling. Actually, if... <clears throat> only one of three uh, collector's rares is the ones I'd keep, and that's uh, Gear Free. Toon Harpy Lady and that Chaos Falcaria. But any other one I'm gonna sell to friends. Rare Desires. I think that's my first time owning Desires, in all honesty. Which I know is weird. Oh, there's my first Ultra. Uh, Toon Page Flip. I think that's probably the worst Ultra you can pull. I guess these guys will just... We'll put them aside, just so we're not confused. No, my gun, I'm just gonna be in frame. I know I do not have the greatest of setup here, but... Gotta make do. Tune bookmark. Oh my god, this is a bad box. <laughs> Two ultras down and they're both garbage. Actually, I forget how much tune bookmark is worth, but... Yikes. And back to back like that. I don't like that. Maybe I'll get about four ultras in this box. That'd be great, actually. Tunker! Don't know why I said it like that. <sighs> don't hate me, please. All I know is I'm gonna have a nice stack of foils after all of this. It's a good reprint. I needed it. I know everyone says that too. 
like I said, I want to make this video as short as possible. There we go. There's one sublimination night. Uh, where am I going to put you? We'll put you on top of that fire emblem box. So there's some of those. I think I need... Oh, yep, that's another card I needed. Evocator of Vec, that'd be cool. Oh, cool. Super magic sort of wrapped in this. Wow, all my ultras on one side? That's really weird. I'm going to test that card out in my deck. I kind of like it. We'll see how that goes. Well, at least I'm getting a box with, uh, with, uh, ultras in it. I know one guy at our locals did pull a, uh, collector's herb, but he didn't get any, uh, ultras out of his box, which is pretty weird. I forget which, uh, I forget which collector's rare it was. I, I don't think it was extravagance or anything. Oh, it was it one of the Chaos guys? Was it Chaos Cyber Dragon or Envoy? Or uh, Blacklist Soldier Envoy, I mean. I don't remember. Oh, cool. Second Sublimination Knight. It's also weird having a pack with all rares. Like, opening the first pack really, uh, threw me off. Uh, four ultras, cool. Chaos to Dalius. Not a good, not a good first box in all honesty, but... Hopefully my luck, uh, turns around. Uh, oh, okay. Um, f five ultras. <laughs> Do I have the sleeves? Did I not bring the sleeves here? Yeah, here we go. Okay. I want to sleeve that up right away. Five ultras out of the first box. What is this? That's crazy. And none of those, I think, are... Uh... Yeah, none of those are collector's rares. Look at that pack just obliterated. <laughs> I don't like that Fluffle Angel card creeps me out. Five Ultras in one box. Has anyone seen that yet? I don't even know. <laughs> Where's my Evocator? That's what I want to pull, too. Chaos Space, that's a good... Uh, probably best super in the set, honestly. Oh, five Ultra rare first... I meant five Ultras in one box. I was about to say, let's make it six. That'd be weird. I guess this, uh, I guess this makes up for the one box that didn't have any. Well, okay, uh, six. <laughs> the, the, this is weird. Six ultras in one box. Okay. Well then. <laughs> Imagine that was just uh, one video on its own. Box number two. That's so weird. Now I really don't care if I don't pull a uh, collector's rare. Because that right there is just nuts. I'm going to put these aside. Just so we know. Just so we know what box it came from. That's just nutty, though. That's really nutty. Let me move that Reflasia. Honestly, what are the odds of that? Like, has anyone else had a box like that? Let me know. Yeah, there he is. Alright, cool. First Evocator of Ek. Probably mispronouncing that, but whatever. Uh, 
Yes. Thank you. Place it over nods. Cards like creeping up in the thirty dollar range. It was like fifteen about when this set first came out. And then the other one, the other noble ignoble knight or infer noble knight in this set is uh, a lot cheaper, but I still play it. I think that's my third uh, Gemini ablation. So that's good. I don't need to put those aside now. Thank goodness. Chaos Valkyria. As you can see, I just threw one into the rare pile. It's your Harpy Lady again. Probably gonna rebuild that deck eventually. So I think they're getting new support or something. Forget what it was, so. There go my sleeves. Nice two chaos spaces in this box. I hope one box isn't going to be short in any uh, ultras now because of that one box. <laughs> but we'll see. I mean, hey, if that's the only ultra out of this box, I'm not complaining. Figured Renault and the Gear Freeds would be the hard ones to get. In fact, I only need one more Gear Freed, though. It was awesome. Luckily, the Infernoble Knight that I didn't pull yet is the uh, cheaper one. I find it funny they have uh, the video game promos in this uh, set as well from the Switch game, which I never purchased. Didn't really see the need to. Alright, let me dispose of this real quick. up here. See, I just still two sublimination knights and then the one uh, vec. Continuing on here. Still the one ultra. I mean, should I really expect any other ultras though? Yeah, there we go. There's a vec number two. I forgot to open. Oh, we don't want to see my arm, do we? <laughs> Not like I have hairy arms or anything. Gear breed. Oh, I no. Something. There we go. Another ultra. I know not a good ultra to pull. I really don't care if I pull extravagance or not. There's our, or my last sublimination I need. Like I said, I only run two of that, but playset would be nice. Pretty much guaranteed to get a place out of that, though. I feel like from three boxes, it makes sense to uh, for that card of all things to be short print. Sublimation Knight. I must put that in uh, my pile. I'm like, wait, no, I already have a place set. Eternal Chaos. Another Desires. Not like I'm keeping track of how many of those I pull, but still, would be nice. No more of that Fluffle Angel, please. It's gonna haunt me. Not bad, we're creeping up to 15 minutes, and I'm almost done with this second box here. Yep, there's my third ultra, okay. So I'm assuming there's nothing in this pack. Yeah, I figured it would just be super. Alright, let's put those to the side. Put these there.
again, make more room for myself. Move on to box number four, three. Even if I wanted a fourth, I couldn't get it. And this is probably all I'm going to really open up this uh, set. Like I said, I'm not going to be upset if I don't pull a uh, collector's or I feel like that's why everybody opens these. Can I get my final gear freed, though? That's the, uh, that's the big question. Put this box there. Or the real question, I should say. Was this third pack? Third pack. So I guess it's going to get short in any ultras. It's not to say that's going to be the case for this box. Is that my first Sigrun? I think that's my first Valkyrie Sigrun. Who put Fire Emblem in Yu-Gi-Oh? Haha, <laughs> kidding. I had to make that joke. I just had to. Come on, Gear Freed. Is that my third of that, I think? Or, uh, Roland. Neat. Tomb Block Luster Soldier. I know that's a card everyone's chasing out of this uh, set as well. Oh, God. <laughs> that's not a good sign. Don't want to see that. It's only ultras you don't want to see. Want to see extravagance or uh, Renault or uh, the Gear Freed or Collector's Rare, even. I feel like any Collector's Rare you pulled is good. I mean, they're all worth something. I don't know how the prices are going to go with that, though, but... Who knows? Now, there's Sigrun number two, I think. This is pack number 11. It's also weird how there's seven cards per pack. Last pack on the right side. Yes! Thank you! I'm happy. <laughs> I'm happy. I don't need to go chasing this guy now. Unless I want to be crazy and get all collector's rares, but... I'm okay with just, uh... With just the ultras. I'm not gonna go crazy like that. He was an ulti, though. That's a different story. Moving on to the uh, left side of the final box. See if we get a collector's rare. Or if we get any more ultras. I feel like. Come on, I have 12 more packs. Probably should get another ultra, right? And obviously, that collector's rare will take the place of your foil. Be foolish to uh, put in a rare slot. My fourth of that, I think. Oh, what am I doing? Take the packs out of there, put the rares in there. More bulk after I just gave my friend Rob a bunch of my bulk. I'll count to see how many packs we have after this. Oh, I thought the light pulsar was a foil. One, two, three, four. Five to go. Hopefully something exciting. But we shall see. Can't complain though. 
here I'm thinking I'm even thinking I wouldn't even pull any Renalds or Gear Freeze. Sublimation Knight. Or is it sublimation? Sublimation. Now I'm pronouncing it right. Team Terrier doesn't look like. Doesn't look like I'm gonna get anything else from this uh, box. And last pack. Is there another Ultra? Is there another, uh, or is there a Collector's Rare? We shall see. Nope. So no Collector's Rare. I obviously was not keeping my hopes up for one. That's weird though, I think only, like I said, two Valkyrie Sigruns, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, only the two Sigruns. Interesting. Well, at least I didn't get shorted any, uh... Shorted any Ultra Rares. So that was, uh, good. Speaking of which, I'll do a recap here. So from the third box, it was Immortal Phoenix Gear Free, Toon Bookmark, and Toon BLS. Uh, the second box, it was Renaud, Toon Bookmark, and Super Magic Sword of Raptinus. And then that crazy first box with one, two, three, four, five, and six Ultra Rares. Pretty nutty. <laughs> But anyway, that's going to do it for this video. Thank you guys, as always, for watching. Um, and yeah, I'll uh, see you next time. Not sure what the next video I upload is, but uh, hopefully by the time I get back from a mini vacation, I can uh, open up that retro game treasure box. I don't know why that hasn't arrived yet. Eh, oh well. Anyway, see you guys next time. Bye for now.